It's never too early for high school football. Hello everyone, I'm Steve Tober of Sideline Chatter, and what better place to start than in North Jersey? The top parochial teams, some of the best public school teams in all of New Jersey are right here in the northern half of the state. Let's begin with number 10. We start up in Sussex County, Chuck Tepper's Vernon Vikings, a team you might not know much about, but they return 17 starters from a 7-3 team, and watch out for quarterback Travis Connolly. At number 9, East Orange Campus, coming off an 11-1 season, Coach Marion Bell's Jaguars return one of the most exciting quarterbacks in New Jersey and 6'4 junior Quadir Pendleton. Our number 18 is Hoboken. Granted, they're group one, but forget about that. This team has experience in running back Des Bates. Number seven, Elizabeth. The Betsy Towners could return to their form of 2006 with a healthy Raymond Graham. And Chet Parlovecchio has won everywhere he's been. At number six is Irvington, also of the Wachung Conference, arrival of Elizabeth, featuring one of the top D1A recruits in all of New Jersey and quarterback safety Josh Evans. The question about the Blue Knights, can they win in late November? This year's squad could answer the call. At number five is Wayne Hills. What more can you say about Chris Olson's Patriots? Right now they start with a 40-game win streak. They graduated a lot off the 12-0 squad, but they have Ryan Daderno at linebacker, Brian Ogden at defensive back. Watch out for more championships for the Patriots. At number four, Bergen Catholic. Fred Stengel's Crusaders catch heat for not beating their parochial rivals, but this club has plenty of talent. All-purpose back Nick Gerst, a veteran quarterback, and Rob Eckrode. Watch out for the Crusaders. At number three in North Jersey is St. Joseph Montfail. Tony Karsich is one of the top offensive minds in all of New Jersey, has a couple of dangerous backs in Kevin Adams and Kamal Hogan, and watch out for linebacker Ryan Donahue. Our number two team, none other than the perennial contender and D1A talent producer, St. Peter's Prep. Gone is Will the Thrill Hill to Florida, but watch out for University of Tennessee-bound Nishir Oliver. All he did last year, rush for 1,300 yards and score 22 touchdowns. And up front, big Daryl Green and ultra-powerful Khalil Wilkes anchor one of the top lines in all of New Jersey. And our number one team, right up there on Route 17, opening the season at Xavier of Cincinnati, moving on to Valley Forge, Pennsylvania, and then De La Salle of California. Who else but Don Bosco Prep. Look for another 12-0 season from this team with a dynamic halfback in Tony Jones, a great two-way back in Dylan Romaine, and a top-flight quarterback in Brett Kniff, not to mention a superior line. We're all getting revved up for North Jersey football. There you have our top 10. For Sideline Chatter, I'm Steve Tober.